been with us every step of the way. I'm sure you recognise it if you were uh, awake with us for the Indian Grand Prix a few races ago. It's slightly changed since then. It's been covered in autographs. If we could actually invite both Rory McIlroy and his other half, Caroline Wozniacki, to just pop in and sign this as well. Of course, the world number two golfer, the world number one tennis player. A couple more autographs to add to the shirt because this is a shirt that's been on quite a journey since we picked it up in India a couple of races ago. We know who's number one in this household. Should we get EJ a new shirt? What have you got this really beautiful colour? Good! Thank you very much. What about my discount? Children in need, they need the money. You can have my shirt. I'm more goes. impressed the fact that he would watch the BBC, no less, for the, from India last weekend. Thanks, George. <laughs> and all those achievements in Formula One, he will forever be remembered as the man who called Paul McCartney George on national television. But this is all for a good cause, Eddie. Just explain what this is all about. Well, apart from the embarrassment, Jake, I blame you. You keep putting me in these okay. positions. In a moment of frenzy, I kind of lost momentarily because we were all such great friends of George's. And, those things pass. But anyway, um, you know, to meet Caroline, who's number one in tennis, and of course Rory here, we still are amazed about how many names are going to be on this shirt, and it will make it the biggest absolute prize for children in need you can ever imagine to buy. So please dig deep into your pockets. This is such a worthy cause. Okay, so there's the message. We've had it signed by every Formula One driver. You just saw Rory and Caroline signing it as well. Um, Eddie's put his scribble on there, and of course, George McCartney as well. And if you'd like to win it, then it's bbc.co.uk forward slash pudsy. You can bid for this in the online auction. All proceeds going to children in need. And